everyone welcome back to my channel today i am finally going to be filming another storing photo cards video it has been about two months since my last one so we are long overdue for a storing video this is the stack of photo cards that we are going to be working with today it is quite the stack quite enormous this is going to be a long one i think so definitely grab a snack grab a drink grab some water and yeah we'll just jump right into it i am going to be starting with my bigger binders today i actually don't have too much for my larger binders surprisingly most of it is going to be in my a5 binders so yeah we'll start with the big binders and work our way down okay so we're gonna start with my itsy and twice binder and we're gonna do twice first because i don't have too much for twice today Need to go right here. So I got this twice pob in a buy haul recently and I figured I would put it in the center here just because like why not I have it so why not just put it with the card. I don't know how I like it. I feel like the set is kind of random and I feel like this just makes it even more random so I don't know if I 100% like how this looks. I don't know. Y'all let me know in the comments. Do you like the pop here or do you think it would look better if it was just a filler? Let me know. And the last card I have to put away is this card. This is Jihyo's Aladdin pre-order benefit for between one and two. It is holographic and stunning. It looks very much like this card, but I don't even care because this look on her, she's absolutely out of her mind. I love her so much. She looks so amazing. So yeah, now I have five pre-order benefits for between one and two, which I <laughs> did not plan on, but I'm really happy with all of these. I don't know if I'll get any more, especially with the comeback happening. I don't know, but we shall see how this section of my binder grows. But that was it for twice. Next we can do Rujin. I think I only have Cheshire stuff for her, which makes sense because her collection is complete up until Cheshire. So yeah, we'll start with this page. Not quite completing Cheshire today, but we're almost there. We're, we're getting there. So I have her neon photo card. Her unit with Leo, which is so cute. Definitely one of my favorites. Her unit with Yuna. The cat ears pose, but, or is this the cherry pose? I don't know. I get a little confused with all the different poses. So this is either the cat ears pose or the cherry pose, whatever you want to call it. Um, and then we have the smiley version, which is so freaking cute. I love that card. And then the glasses version. Again, another superior PC. Okay, so the only one missing is her unit with Yeji, which I do have on the way. So this will be complete in my next Storing PCs video, and I just love how the backs look. I think this turned out really, really nice. Okay, so for this page, I have white, a few cards. I have all of her limited cards. So we have this card. Her lenticular. I don't know if you can really see that on camera or not. And then we have this last card for the limited set. And then for the special edition, I have these two cards. I don't really know what version should go on top, the red or the blue, so I'm just kind of putting them in here. So yes, those two are poles in my albums. And then I actually have all three of the blue version cards. So that is really exciting. super happy that I was able to find trades for these. I was a little nervous, but it ended up working out. So I'm really happy. And yeah, I have this card on the way as well. So next during photo cards video, we will be completing Cheshire for sure. So yeah, that was it for this binder. Not too much, but 
some really good progress on my Etsy collection especially, so I'm really happy to have these cards all put away. But let's move on to the next binder. Okay, so next we have my NCT and EXO binder. So I do have some OT9 stuff to put away today. I think this is sorted, but let me just check. Yeah, it is. Okay, so for this set, I have Jungwoo. This is his sticky version card from Sticker. Go right there. Ah, oh, yay! So just missing Doyoung. He is on the way, so the set will be complete. And then for the Soul City version, I have three cards: Taeyong, Yuta, and Doyoung. Okay. So yay, just missing Mark again. Mark is on the way as well. So this set will be done. My next storing video, oh, love this set. This Johnny card, 10 out of 10, so good. Um, and then for this set, I have Jungwoo and Mark. So there's that. I have Yuta on the way, still missing Taeyong. I've seen him for an okay price, but I am just kind of like waiting it out to see if I can find him for an even more reasonable price. But yeah, really happy on my progress with Sticker. So far, I'm almost done. I'm just missing that Taeyong card, which is amazing. And then for favorite, this is the classic version. I just have Taeyong right now but as you can see by the purple sleeves I have quite a few members on the way for this set. I figured this set would be pretty easy to complete and I was not incorrect in thinking that so. And then for the catharsis version I have Taeyong and Jungwoo. There we go. I think the set is going to be really nice once I get all the cards. So yeah, that was my progress for favorite. And then two baddies. I have two cards. We have Taeyong and Johnny for this set. Okay, just missing Doyoung, I think. Yeah, Doyoung is the only member I'm missing for two baddies now, so just need this card and his digipack, and I will be done with two baddies, which is, again, very, very crazy to me. Here is the setup for Ayo, a little sneak peek of my progress so far. Um, this is empty because I actually have all of the S mini cards secured, so... That's exciting. Next storing video is going to be full of AO photo cards. Now we can move on to Mark. So in my setting up video, I said I wasn't going to make placeholders for his older cards, but I've actually gotten offers for a few trades for his older cards, so I figured I might as well just set up for it. You know, what could it hurt? So I do have his We Go Up photo card on hand. So freaking adorable. And I'm just double checking that I have the placement right for his cards. Okay, yes. So this card is gonna go right here. And I did get a trade offer for his We Young photo card, which will go in the middle. So yeah, we're making progress. And then for this page, I have two photo cards. I have his crazy version card from Hot Sauce and his Hello Kino from Hello Future, which is so cute. I got this for like $5, very crazy to me, but I will take it. Oh, so adorable. I love these cards. And I have all three of these on the way, so this page will be complete very soon. Ooh. I'm gonna switch that. So the backs are broken up a little bit. 
think it also makes sense with his hair color as well so yeah i like that a lot better um, and then for this page i just have his scratch version photo card which goes up there i do have his lenti on the way still looking for his new school photo card and then we have some candy photo cards so excited to put these away so i have his make star pre-order benefit i have his photo book card there and i also have his digipack photo card go up here so yes i have the special version and s mini cards on the way so this will be complete very soon as well oh the packs are so precious yay i love that um that was it for this binder actually i don't have anything for exo today shocker but yeah some really good progress i mean something is better than nothing so i'll take it all right time for the a5 binders i just have a few cards for my it's the ot5 binder so i need to go back to cheshire so I did change the set that I'm going to be collecting for this era. Instead of the limited version, I'm going to collect the sunglasses version. I don't know. I just like wanted to collect this set instead and there aren't really any rules with this collection. So yeah, I did have Chase already from a group order poll. I have Yeji secured and I have a trade coming for Yuna. So just missing Leah. So yeah, excited about that. I did make some changes to this binder since you last saw it. So I have moved my Rujin pre-order benefit photo cards into this binder. I don't really see myself thoroughly collecting her pre-order benefits ever. I really just kind of want to get one per era and have that be that. So that's why I felt okay with moving her pops in here because this isn't going to grow very quickly. So yeah, I do have this pop for Cheshire. This is one of her Make Star pre-order benefits. Oh my god, I got I got new um, Amnifa sleeves in and I feel like they changed the material of these because they feel like the Beyond D pages. They still fit the standard size sleeves and they're still double-sided but the material definitely feels weird and I am finding it to be a bit harder to get the cards into the sleeves. It's just like really stiff. I don't know if it's because these are just really new <laughs> and my other ones are really, really old, but yeah, I definitely see a difference for sure. And I'll just show really quickly, I did move Rujin's large inclusions in here as well, just because the binder had a lot of room in it and it's not something that's gonna be growing super quickly. So yeah, I just moved them in here for now. I have to cut white papers for a lot of this. So yeah, TBD on that for when I am not lazy, but yeah, just a small update there. But that was it for this binder, super quick. Next we can do my 17 Japanese photo card binder. I just have stuff for dream. So let's start here. Hmm. This is gonna be fun <laughs> trying to figure this out. I think this Mingyu goes on this page, right? Or am I wrong? No, I'm wrong. Do I not have that Mingyu? Hmm. Or does this Mingyu? Oh, okay. <laughs> I messed up. I forgot. I'm putting. S coops at the top and Mingyu at the bottom. So this Mingyu does go on this page. This is his limited D version photo card. And that is his limited A. And I also have S coops's limited A or limited D. Oh my goodness. All twisted around. Okay, so yeah, I'm not going in version order. I'm going off of outfits. So yeah, the limited A and limited D cards were in the same outfit, so that's why they're together. And then here, I'm gonna put the limited C cards. So cute. I'm really happy to have these. So 
yeah, that is that page done. And then I am finishing out this page because I have this song chol. So almost done with Dream, just missing this last chol card. I don't know why this card is going for like $30 on Mercari Japan and I'm just not paying that much for a card, I'm sorry. I don't have it in me. So yeah, for now, this is what we got. I'm pretty happy with it. Another change to my collection, I did downsize my 17 non-album section quite a lot. Um, this is all that is left of my non-album photo card collection for 17, so yeah, I just, having three binders for 17 did not make me feel great, and I just realized those cards just sat in that binder. I did not look at them. I just bought them to buy them, and I just know they'll be better off in another home that will really love them and cherish them and it'll help complete someone's collection. So yes, I did not downsize any of my pops or fan sign photo cards. I just moved those to my Korean album photo card binder. So the next time we're in that binder, I'll show y'all what I did. But yeah, I just thought I would update you on that. But that was it for this binder. All right, next up we have my Yeti binder, one of my favorite binders. And I have a super exciting card. Oh my God, I can't believe I own her. Thank the Lord SM reprinted these because I would have never owned this card otherwise. But yeah, this is her bad boy Kino photo card. Are we kidding? Yay! I'm so excited to have this because that like really completes my Yeti collection. That was kind of the one card that I didn't have in terms of album photo cards, but now I do. So yeah, I'm pretty freaking stoked about it. Um, okay, next I have this Queendom photo card. This is one of her Mumo Pobs that I just picked up on a whim because that's what I do for Yeti. And yeah, it helps balance out this four pocket page, I think, because Queendom only had three album photo cards. So yeah, happy to have that. Okay. And now for birthday, I am not putting away my pops just yet. I'll do that in the next video, but I do have two of her album photo cards. So I have her cake version and her digi pack. I love this card. I think it's freaking stunning. And I do have her mint S mini photo card. It's just with my pops. So I will be getting that soon. Yeah. And the last card for this binder is this. This is one of her SMCU palace photo cards. This is her ID portrait card, I think. So it's going to go right here here. Yay! So for this, I have everything except for her... No, I actually don't have everything. I have her palace photo card, I think. I don't think I have either of these because I bought these albums. Just waiting to ship them out for my K-Addy. So yeah, happy to have that one and happy to have her palace card secured. But yeah, that was it for Miss Yedem today. Okay, last two binders, but these are the two most exciting binders in my opinion. So we're gonna start with Stacy because I got my fix slot group order in for We Need Love. So I can finally put all these cards away. Oh my God, I'm so freaking excited. This has been a long time coming. So we have the last two album photo cards that I was missing. So, so happy to finally be putting these away. Cannot even begin to describe how happy this makes me. So the photo book cards are done and I have her Digipack photo card. So cute. So album cards, done. Now we can get into all of the pre-order and fan sign photo cards that I collected. So I have these in order, pretty sure. So this should be pretty quick and painless, but this is Everline round one. 
my goodness. Yay! Oh gosh, it feels so good to put these away. You have no idea. Then we have with you round one. Such a stunning photo card. I honestly love all these cards so much. She really outdid herself this time. We have her Weaver's Pob. I am so excited to get the teddy bear cards because yeah, they are all so cute. This is Mixar. Especially with her pink hair, I just think she's so adorable. Look at the back, oh I love it. This card is the only card I don't have on hand right now, but it will get to me eventually. We have the first round of Apple Music. Maka Chop. I have both of her Apple Music Lucky Draws. I'm happy that these are normal sizes. I feel like sometimes the Apple Music cards are really skinny for whatever reason, which makes no sense to me, but yeah, these are just normal photo card size. Cute! Oh, I love the doodles. Then we have Beat Road. The filter on this one is kind of weird. I feel like they really bumped up the saturation for some reason. Then we have Everline round two. With Moo round two. This arrow was really weird because they only did one round of Make Star and that just seemed really wrong to me. Very, very odd. And this is Apple Music round two. Cute. And then the last page is arguably my favorite page. We have some stunning cards here. So this is Everline round three, Princess Suman. I'm obsessed. She's so cute. And we have with Moo round three with the bunny ears. This is the Everline Digipack Polaroid. They are doing so many events for the Digipacks this time around for um, Teddy Bear. I am going to have enough Digipack photo cards to collect Isa and Sayon. Like that's how many claims I've joined for pre-order benefits associated with the Digipack. Absolutely insane. Um, and lastly, we have Apple Music Round 4, which is my favorite pre-order benefit of the era. I just think this is a freaking stunning photo card. I think she looks beautiful, her eyeshadow, and I love the back so much. I think it's so cute. So yes, this is definitely my favorite card of them all. So yay, we are almost done. So close to being done. Just need this one card to come in and then We Need Love will be finished. So beautiful. Love everything about this. Yay! Okay, and then the last card I have to put away to first zoom in is one of her poppy photo cards. So I'm not sure which one this is. I think this might be one of the limited cards. So yeah, I'm just gonna put this right at the top. And then I have another one coming. And I joined an Everline group order for her member cover. So I'll hopefully get that photo card in that group order. And then I'll have her Everline pop to put here. And that will be it for Poppy. And then obviously I started to set up for Teddy Bear. I have not gotten around to making more fillers. I honestly don't know if I will at this point because there's just so much. And I feel like that is kind of a waste of paper because I know all those cards will get to me eventually. I just don't know when and they're all going to arrive at the same time. So I don't really know if I want to make placeholders for everything. I don't know. We'll see. But yeah, that was it for Zoom In. So much progress. I just love her. I think she's everything to me. So yay. <laughs>
Okay, last binder for this video, we have my Jaehyun binder, which is the majority of the stack, to be honest. I have some really exciting cards in here. I cannot wait to put them away. So yeah, let's just get started. So on this page, I do have one of his empathy photo cards. Very gorgeous. I never thought I would own his empathy cards. Very crazy to me that I have them. And we have his other empathy card. I traded a twice photo card for this, which is just so amazing. Like, thank you so much to the person that traded me. I wanted this card for the longest time. Like since I started collecting Jaehyun and looking at his templates, I've always thought this is the most stunning photo card. So to now have it in my possession, beautiful. Love it, love that for me. And then we have his regulate photo card. So yes. On this page, we have his Neozone Kino, another card I never thought I would own. Again, without the SM reprints, I would not own this card, like 100%. And this card too, like absolutely not, but I have him, he's so gorgeous. Then on this page, I have his Departure version Kino. So this page is done, Resonance Part 2 officially complete, stunning, gorgeous, amazing. And for this page, I have his two favorite Kino photo cards. This card I think is so gorgeous. I feel like I'm just repeating myself, but I love collecting Jaehyun, uh, makes me so happy. So yeah, this page is done too. And for SMCU, I just have his Nighttime Pass photo card. So yeah, there is that, done, nothing for the palace release, that's fine. And then here I have another round of Itsu for favorite. I think in my setting up video I said that I thought I had all of the rounds for favorite, but that is a lie. I am missing one of the rounds, but I don't know if I'm going to get it, to be honest. So I have these three cards. This card is my favorite. He's so derpy and I love him for it. So I think these are the Mumo cards from favorite, probably. And then this is another round of ECU. So yeah, I think that's where I'm gonna stop for favorite and sticker. I just, I'm satisfied with this, it's fine. I don't need any more. So yeah, I'm excited to have that done. Okay, next we're gonna jump into two baddies pops, but I need to get a template out because I am not gonna know where these go. Where is my Jason template? Okay, here we go. Nothing for this page. This page is complete page is complete. Oh my god, I think in my setting up video I thought that this was his Hot Tracks card, but it is not. Hello, this is his Busan fan sign card, and that should go here. What? <laughs> this is his Hot Tracks card, and it is hollow. This is the danger of collecting an idol that looks the same in all of his photo cards. So, there we go. I feel like Vernon stands could also feel my pain right now. But yeah, this page is done again. <laughs> okay, then we have Shopee, which I don't have yet. And then we have this Blue Dream Media fan sign card. So there's that. And then we have the Shopee K pop merch card. Which again, it's like, spot the difference. <laughs> I feel so silly putting these cards away because they literally all look the same. This card is the invitational event. So we're kind of skipping around a little bit, but yes. I really like this card actually. I think it's really cute. Um, and then this card is the street sign event number two. So this 
Bird. And then I do have his deluxe box card. So right here, I traded for this. So that's fun. Okay, coming along. Coming along. I have everything on the way except for this last lucky draw. That's the only thing that I need to still purchase. Other than that, I am done with the fan sign cards for two baddies, so that's nice. And then lastly for this page, I just have some merch cards that I want to put away. So this card, which has a dog hair on it, story of my life. Um, this is his hollow card. And then these two came in like a trading card set, I think. So yeah, I'm unsure. Do I want to put the selfie up here? I think so. I'll put the concept card down here. So yeah, just some random merch cards I picked up that I thought were cute. So yeah, that page is done. Nothing for Ayo just yet, but I'm just gonna very quickly put away his DeFesta photo cards. Um, I was gifted this for Christmas and I was gifted Jaehyun's version. So I'm just gonna put all of his cards in here. These aren't all the cards that you got, but these are just the ones that I liked the most that I wanted to put in the binder. Starting with this thing of beauty, one of my favorite Jaehyun cards, and it came in a DeFesta release. Very crazy. We have this one, the dimple, so cute. This one, and then this one was one of the like special cards that you got if you, based on like the member version that you ordered, so there's that. Then on the back I'm gonna put the Polaroid style ones. I'm just double siding these because I really don't care about the backs. This has got to be like top 10 funniest Jaehyun photo cards of all time. Hilarious. Hilarious. And we have this one. And the other special photo card. This one is a lenticular. You can barely tell. She's gonna go back there that looks like so yeah that was it for this storing pcs video i feel like it wasn't as long as i thought i feel like i kind of breezed through it a little bit but still made some exciting progress on some collections today that i'm super happy about and yeah it was a lot of fun all right everyone that's gonna do it for today's storing photo cards video i hope you enjoyed watching me put away all of these cards and yeah i will see you soon in another one soon bye mm -hmm.